What up, though? It's your boy DJ Star back with another unboxing. But before we do that, please subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you know when I'm dropping new content. And also, please like, comment, and share the videos. It goes a long way to help the channel grow. Still pushing for those subscribers. And last but not least, make sure you check the links down below. That's how you help the channel grow. So with all that YouTube stuff being said, we're going to get right into it. And we're going to make it quick. As you see the box, I'm pretty sure you know what it is. As we look at it, you got a black top with a small gold jump, man. You got the 23 on the side, done in that 23 Jordan font, which I always love. The bottom, the back is black. And then you don't have nothing on this side. And then when you get to the front of the shoe, you got one gold loop to grab it and let air in. And we are going over the Air Jordan 11 Retro. Colorway is white, metallic, gold, black. This is an eight and a half, not my personal pair. But my personal pair is already in. So we're going to go inside the box real fast. I can get this open. It'd be kind of hard to get this joker open because it's so heavy. It's a nice sturdy box too, for real. Uh, and it won't open for me. Alright, real quick, and we're back, and as you see down the box, we got that Jordan 23 font, or that Jordan 11 font that says thank you, actually let me turn it this way, so you can see it better, so you can see it spelled out, now you can see it says thank you, done really, really nice, shiny, 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 um, the, the paper is done especially as well, as you can see on here, you might see a few words that you recognize, but I believe, and I want to say is thank you, it is every language they possibly could think of, the Donka, or it's thank you in German, gracias, is thank you, I believe, in Spanish. And it was another one on here I just seen, mercy. That may be, I don't see where it's at. It says thank you right there in English. But it said mercy on here somewhere. And I want to say that is thank you in, correct me if I'm wrong, in French. So, and as always, as you see in the box, they got a quality control stamp right over there. And I'm going to go over that in the video. So let's get right into it. So today we are reviewing the Air Jordan 11 Gratitude. Um, and it is basically based off the DMP, but it's some upgrades and changes. And if you've been watching my channel for any length of time, you know I am an Air Jordan 11 fanatic. This is my favorite silhouette of the Air Jordan line, period, point blank, period, hands down. Period. So these are fresh and these fire. I already got mine in from the um, shock drop, but um, I wanted to do review of this pair because it's better light here. So with that being said, we're gonna start at the bottom as always. As you see, you got the nice Air Jordan 11 outsole, but this time it's not done in ice. It's done in like a cream. So hopefully that won't, um, you know, saying yellow is bad or look as bad when it starts to yellow, but it's just a nice cream and it's a nice creamy effect too, and I like it. Um, you got your Air Jordan. Um, 11 traction pods right here right here remember you got your carbon fiber in the middle and the carbon fiber on here is like black with a gold tint to it which is really nice and also remember your air jordan 11 has a full length air units starting from right here all the way back to the heel and then you got your jumpman in the middle now you go to that midsole it is done that crispy clean white no sale no nothing but then as always on the Air Jordan 11, when you get up to the upper, it's done in that nice, really, really nice cut of patent leather, as you see, just shining and gleaming in this. You know, for these, they've been doing a higher cut of patent leather over the last few years, which is really, really a dope touch. But the star of this shoe in particular is when you get up to the leather. Still in having your ballistic mesh or cordura mesh right up here on your Jordan 11 like you normally do, you got leather. And this is real leather. Now, on this pair, it's kind of stiff, but I noticed on my um, pair, it was really, really soft and supple. The tongue is done in coarse leather as well. You can feel it when you touch it. It's a nice tumble effect to it. On your third run, you got um, Jumpman with the gold Jumpman in the middle. But what I noticed on these, which I didn't notice on mine, these thick shoelaces that come with the Air Jordan 11, these look kind of dingy or maybe they look a little tinted, like tan or something. I'm not sure, but I'm not sure if mine look like that because I haven't actually looked, 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 looked at them. So you get over here, you got your nice piece of leather back here, and then you got your gold Jumpman facing frontwards, and it's like... Uh, it's not like those um, them holiday or the Jubilee joints where you could tell it was like a pen, a thick pen. I'm not sure what this process is, but it's, it's done nicely. And then you get to the back, you got your 23 and that Jordan 11 font on the back. And this is done nicely as well. It's not that felt. It's like they probably glued it on, but they glued a nice little piece on. So that's what makes it look really nice, in my opinion. Um, you get around to the medial side of the shoe, you just got more of the same. And... 
all this leather right here. But like I said, mine feels a lot softer than this to the touch, but it's still a nice shoe. I mean, you can't go wrong with this Air Jordan 11, especially, you just can't go wrong with Air Jordan 11s, but especially not in a classic colorway like this, which is really, like I said, a play on the DMP, which was a play on the Concords. And you go into the inside, you got a black insole with the 23 done in gold, and it's really, really shiny. And then the last little hint detail behind the tongue, you got thank you on both sides of it. You got quality basketball product, is it? Yeah, created for the best, greatest basketball player ever. Or correct me when I'm wrong, I, I can't get that right, but I don't want to peel this tongue back because this is not my pair. So other than that, man, tell me what you think of the Air Jordan 11 Gratitude, man. I think they're fire, man. My Concord still look good. Um, they're not so yellow on the bottom. They're still not icy, but they're not yellow. But I just had to have this pair. This is like a totally different pair to me, even with the gold hits. I just thought it was too dope. And I'm ahead. I love Air Jordan 11s. So I had to have it. Now, next year, if they drop that UNC, that white with the UNC blue, that'll be the first time in a long time I passed on the actual holiday 11 Jordan. I think the only Jordan I really, 11, I really remember passing on that was um, the regular mid cut was that, um, I don't even remember what it's called. I'm going to put a picture in the video, but it was spicy something or I don't know. We was calling it eggnog when it came out a few years ago. But um, that's it, man. Tell me what you think of the Air Jordan 11 DMP. I definitely had to get me a pair. going to get my daughter a pair and definitely going to get my son a pair. So that's all I got to say about it, man. I love this shoe, man. So comment down below and let me know what you think if you're going for these or not. And, you know, what's your preference when it comes to Air Jordan 11? So let me know, man. But... Other than that, man, we're going to get up out of here. As always, subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you know when I'm dropping new content. Um, make sure you um, like, comment, and share on the videos. It goes a long way to help the channel grow. Still pushing with subscribers. And other than that, hit those links down below so the channel can grow. So with that being said, man, we're going to get on out of here. Oh, uh, run time, I forgot. This shoe is released in December 9th for a retail price of $230. Need to put that in the video. I'm sorry, y'all. So other than that, man, I'm going to get on out of here as always. Love, peace, and prosperity. I'm gone.